Right guys, so today we're gonna to talk about something very important, stretching, okay? And I'm gonna focus the stretching today in the leg, the glutes, hamstrings. There are many ways of stretching, right? But I wanna show you something that is very safe. You do it in a controlled way. A lot of the times when you stretch, you overstretch. Or when you stretch, you already start in an overstretch position. And this is what you don't want. So I'm gonna show you today the way that I do and I recommend to all my clients. It's very easy, very simple. It makes a difference, okay? So we're gonna start with the stretch hamstrings, right? So hamstrings, let's start with the left side, okay? So if you want to do a stretch on the hamstrings, you have to make sure you focus only on the hamstrings. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna stretch the leg, right? Stretch the leg and relax the foot. You don't want to keep the foot up. Why? Because if you keep the foot up, now you're stretching the, the gastrocnemics, you're stretching the calf muscles. You don't want that, right? You just want everything relaxed, legs straight, knees relaxed. Second position is you have to lift your body up as high as you can, sit up straight, right? Now, the key here is you're going to bend forward, but you're not going to roll like this. You're going to bend from your hip, you're going to hinge from your hip, you're going to keep everything straight. So as you bend forward, you're gonna look up. And you see that for me, when I reach around that angle, I start feeling the pull on the hamstrings, all right? For some people, they have to go a little bit further. But that stretch is very controlled and it's very specific for the hamstrings. You cannot go wrong with this because you're going slow, you're taking your time, and again, it's pretty safe. If you want to focus more on the outer side of the hamstrings, you can turn the leg out and do the same thing. If you want to focus more on the inner part, rotate the leg in and do the same thing. The key is to keep everything straight and bend slowly until you feel a stretch there. Once you feel the stretch, hold it 20 seconds, repeat three times. That's an amazing stretch for your hamstrings, okay? Now, uh, we're going to talk about the stretch for the glutes. Again, a lot of people, they already start overstretching the glutes. Or when they stretch the glutes, they compromise the lower back alignment or pelvic alignment. You don't want this. So what you have to do now is this. Right here. Sit up straight as much as you can. If you don't sit up straight, you're going to compromise your lower back. You're going to stretch your lower back, create problems down the line. You don't want this. You want to keep everything straight. You're going to bend, hinge from the hip until you feel a stretch on the glutes, which is right here. Once you feel that stretch, hold it 20 seconds. Don't test. As soon as you feel the tension point, you hold it 20 seconds. All right? After that, you do the other side as well. Repeat three times, this is stretch. Okay? It's very, very focused, very specific, and very controlled. Okay? With very minimal momentum. That's what you want. Another important stretch is once you finish this one, you go back, the glutes have different layers, have different angles. So this one is stretching one particular part of the muscle. Then you go back a little bit, then you can hold the knee and just pull that knee towards the opposite shoulder now. Now you're going to feel a different type of stretch in different location. Again, don't twist because you compromise your lower back. Everything straight, look up, just bring that shoulder, bring the L, um, knee towards the opposite shoulder. When you feel that stretch, you hold it 20 seconds. Repeat that three times. So this sequence, hamstrings, glutes, it, it's a perfect stretch for you to add into your routine of exercise. And this is very safe. If you have an injury on the hamstrings, if you have an injury on the glutes, you cannot re-injure because you're doing a controlled way. Most of the stretch you see online, people already overstretch or they start in an overstretch position. Okay, so this is my um, top three stretches for glutes and hamstrings that I'm pretty sure is going to make a difference in your health.